Welcome back to Who the F***. It's the show that aims to take a deep dive in some of the acts announced for Reading and Leeds 2019. In today's video, we're looking at Destruction Boys. They're a production and DJ duo from South Africa. If you've never heard of them before, hopefully this video will help answer the question, Who the F***? Destruction Boys. Destruction Boys are made up of two members, Tho Bunny and Zifo, also known as Q and Goldmax. They're from Durban in South Africa and they make a genre of music called Gwom. There is no easy way of teaching you how to say Gom. If you say Gom or Com or Com or Gom, at the end of the day, we understand you're talking about gom music. It's a subgenre of house music that rose to fame in the late 90s and early noughties. It kind of focuses on hard, broken, offbeat drums. It kind of reminds me of um, that FOMO record, what's it called? Centavo. Watch, watch your phone. Any of you kids know that, that know that record, I'll be impressed. Other popular noir artists include DJ Lag, Rude Boys, and DJ Mefarissa. The two established themselves playing at local taverns and, and Sisha Nayamas in and around Kawamashu, where they were born. A, uh, a Sisha Na Neymar is a Zulu phrase which literally means burnt meat. It's somewhat of a semi-public barbecue. They're owned by local butchers as a place where, where a community can get together and cook, and cook meat on an open fire together. But they're also kind of like nightclubs but with steak. Sounds great. They would later go on to join forces and then release the album Mom is the Future in 2017. They would achieve gold in South, in South Africa, making it the first Mom album to reach that status. They then released their follow-up album It Was All A Dream in late last year. Also in 2018, they worked with fellow African artist Mr. Easy on the track Open and Close. Don't give me step over, I'm not a footballer. Their most popular record is a song called Omune. <laughs> Currently on 10 million hits on YouTube, and was also featured in the Marvel film Black Panther. This will be their first time playing Reading and Leeds, and I can't see them play, having played in the UK much in the past, but they're taking to the dance stage on the Friday afternoon. I'm not going to pretend that I'm the biggest one fan in the world. Bearing in mind I literally didn't know it was a genre 20 minutes ago, I'm quite interested in it. Musically, I think it's got a lot more going for it than a lot of the deep and tech house that's out there. And currently, on that Friday afternoon, it looks like there's a bit of a dry spell uh, with not no clashes or anyone that I particularly want to see. So I actually feel that I'm, I'm more interested in seeing these guys than, than anyone else at that moment. I mean, I guess they could clash with Joji. I haven't done my video on him yet. I've not done the right research, so we'll see. But the dance stage is right next door to the NME stage, so we're all good. So if only just to satisfy my own curiosity of how this works in a DJ set and just being generally interested in the response and energy of the crowd, I'm going to go with a 6 out of 10. Bring one to Reading and Leeds. Brilliant. What do you think? Have you, are you someone who listens to one music a lot? Is it something that you've ever heard of before? As I said, I'm brand new to it. And I only know how to pronounce the word because I watched a, a documentary on it. I highly recommend watching that mini doc. It's on YouTube. I'll try and link it below. Let me know your thoughts in the comments section and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers. Bye.